Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to check how much organic SEO traffic a website gets from Google and other search engines, right? So if you want to get an estimate how much search traffic a website gets from Google, so from SEO traffic primarily, you can use a tool like SEMrush. If you haven't used SEMrush before, I will link it in the description below, and you can use that link to get a free trial of SEMrush and then check out the organic SEO traffic of any website, your competitors, or if you are doing any kind of niche research. It's a really useful tool that you can use to not only check how much SEO traffic a website gets, but do keyword research, backlink analysis, and a lot more. All right, so, but once you've signed up for SEMrush, all you have to do to be able to check how much search traffic a website gets is to click on the organic research tab on the left here. And then all you have to do is add the domain name of the website. Of course, you can also get an estimate of a specific U URL, how much web traffic of specific URL gets. For this example, let's use nerdwallet.com, which is a personal finance, investing, insurance, credit card review website. So then click on search. And as you can see here, we're gonna be able to get an overview of the organic SEO traffic of this website. So as you can see, they get around 80 million organic visits per month from Google search and other search engines. You can also see that they are ranking for more than 3.9 million keywords. And the estimated value of these organic traffic is more than 89 million USD. So this value is usually calculated by the using the CPC of the keywords they are ranking for. And you can also get an overview of what is the branded slash non-branded traffic share from this organic traffic. So you can see, although they have a strong brand now, so a lot of people are checking out Nerd Wallet when they want to review a financial product, get a review of a financial product, or learn more about the specific finance concept they still get most of their traffic from non-branded uh, search queries. If you scroll down on this page, you can even get more insights. So if you want to check out what kind of organic keywords they are ranking for, you can get a glimpse here and check out all of their organic keywords by clicking here. You can also see which new keywords are they ranking for or, or which keywords they have lost in the last couple of months or weeks and where they have declined in terms of organic rankings and stuff like that. You can also learn more about what kind of keywords they are ranking for. So this is a great report that you can check out here in more details if you click here, but you can see whether they are ranking for informational keywords, navigational, commercial, or transactional keywords. So as this is more like an info website, most of the traffic is coming for informational keywords. But if you are analyzing an e-commerce SEO website, you would see a lot of transactional keywords here in terms of percentages. You can also see what kind of um, feature snippets and site links and people also ask queries they are ranking for. You can also get an overview of their top ranking pages, which are getting the most organic SEO traffic, their main organic competitors. And you can also use these links to check out them and analyze them analyze them to a similar way. You can also get a competitive positioning map here. So there's a lot of tools that you can use here to check out the organic SEO traffic of this website. And one great thing about SEMrush compared to Ahrefs or other SEO tool is that they also getting you some non-organic SEO traffic data. So if you click on traffic analytics here, you're gonna be able to see how much overall traffic nerdwallet.com gets. You're not only gonna get an overview of the organic traffic but other traffic as well you can see here how much uh, paid and search or social traffic they are getting here if you want to get that information click on traffic analytics here then traffic journey here and you can get more information about that as well so this is how to find out how much organic seo traffic a website gets using semrush if you want to learn more about semrush check out the other tutorials i have on semrush and you can also grab the free trial link in the description below